it hasn't really been a challenge. It's just like every guy is good. So when you get the ball, maximize your opportunities with it. And just be embrace it. Embrace being in a good offense because we're winning. We're playing ball all around, and everybody's having fun. And everybody beat us, so I'm happy. With it. Has it been surprising in that way? Um, not really. Um, just being a team player is all like I can do, and that's all I what our my goal was at the beginning of the year. What I can do best is if the ball's not in my hands. How can I best involve my teammates, whether that's in a pass run, whatever it may be, on the sideline if I need to be, whatever it may be. I just want to encourage my teammates to do the best of my ability that I can, whether the ball's in my hand or not. What's your advice to some of the young freshmen in that wide receiver room for their first road game? Um. Just embrace it, you know, just let everything out. There's probably going to be mistakes within the game, but as, just trust yourself, trust your technique, trust what you've been doing Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday practice leading up to Saturday because everything you do in practice is going to help it be easier for Saturday games. Three games in now, how, how do you explain, I guess, or, or describe just being a part of an offense that, that's put up numbers the way this one has? Uh, it's really good. Um, because the way our offense is set up, like we have so many playmakers, like the playmakers make our offense, uh, the offense don't make us. So it's just good seeing the playmakers getting involved and doing what we got to do to make plays happen. And seeing everybody make plays just makes me, when the ball gets in my hand, I got to make a play too. Obviously, you saw what Caleb did last year. He worked up through practice, beginning of the games. Does anything surprise you about what he does on Saturdays and games? Um. No, not really. Like like I said before, um, seeing everything in practice for the first time or during spring is just like to see who he truly is. And it also leads into games because whatever he does in practice, he's going to do it in games. He's not going to try to do something that he's not comfortable with or stuff like that. What do you think of that? Mary, I guess, could you take us through that pass that Caleb completed to you as he's kind of falling out of bounds? Like, were you sure that that ball was coming to you? Like, it seemed, even uh, just watching it, like it was just going to go out of bounds. Yeah, no, I um, scramble rules, um, like like usual, just scramble rules, wherever the quarterback's going, follow him, just don't start running. So that's what I did. I followed him, I didn't start running, and eventually the ball was let out, and I had to go track it down. As the ball is kind of coming to you, and yep. you're tracking it, were you surprised at all that he somehow managed to get it there, even though he was kind of falling out of bounds? Um, when 13 got the ball in his hands, you can never be surprised. Fair enough. Did he tell you anything about catching up with Oh, no. As long as I make the catch, we're all good. How tempting is it to get a one-hander every now and then? Just give them your shoulder. Um, it's really a feel thing. Like sometimes I feel like I can't grab the ball with two, so I'll stick one hand out there. But I don't try to grab the ball one. It's just an instinct thing. Dorian, what have you learned from moving your locker closer to Caleb? I think you told us last time we talked that you moved it next to him. What have you learned, and what's that been like? Um, just um, learning from him. Like each and every day, we joke and laugh. But when the football time comes, it's like business and we're helping each other he's helping me like just things that he sees on the field things i see on the field just building a relationship are you happy you made that switch yeah definitely any extra excitement for you just going back to the state of arizona i'm excited to see um, my extended family out there in arizona see some old teammates i used to play with yeah so it's happy to be back there sorry if someone asked this but um coming in we're, we're sort of Um, just things like come being out here, or I mean, after practice or coming after a workout, just doing the things that's not within our schedule, just to build that relationship and chemistry.